a retake in life. Different takes, different breaks. To partake in the poem, the poetry. The poetry of life. The wife to nature, mother nature. And then the cosmic God. You call him, yes, Mr. Universe. Ah, yes, all those verses, 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 and psalms, and palms, and keep it repetitive and consistent and not. Jazz-like but slow. Keep it classical, tempestuous, and yet contained within the psyche. The more you see, the more you like. And sometimes you say, when does the poem start? When shall I make art and know to derive from the right source? Shocker, Shakespeare. Yes, Jeremy Bentham. Francis Hutchison. It's good to mention that within a poem, within a poem, within a poem, within a poem. To keep it formal and stoic and yet not be stoic in your everyday life. Say I'm more fatty to some people who are fatty and skinny, but then know yourself and know thyself and be true and philosophical, introspective, contemplate the navel. Say often things that you would often say to yourself in the mirror and say, I am that mirror. I am me at the end of the universe. Don't you see the secret of light under that light? It's still light, luminescent and bright. Yes. Shall I fight? No. Sometimes I just wish to love. Love making, the art of love making. You just want to do it and do it. But it's different to lust making. Yes, it's different to lust making. All kinds, all kinds, all kinds. And we all find somewhere, somewhere beyond, beyond this and beyond that. Uh, sometimes you have to adjust yourself and be flat. The flatlands where you see the horizon line. You feel good to be alive once again. You feel good to be alive and you appreciate those that sometimes annoy and play the toy. But do not fall for voodoo. Voodoo is not the real way. Yes, rational logic, Pythagorean logic, all of those different places and graces and faces that you meet and all of the streets, boy, you could just take it all in. Take one, take two, take three, take four, take five. Me, the fifth, plead the fifth, innocence until proven guilty. Ancient, the ancient soliloquy of the oral tradition, which goes back and now automation. Ah, the fragrant scent. Sometimes it takes me a while to find that moment. It takes me a while and a while and a while and a while to realize I'm actually a kind gentleman, unhinged, speak for myself. I will. Sometimes a grandfather's you and a grandmother and another grandfather and a mother and a father or a mom and dad. But don't say it too much like that or they'll make you sad. They'll make you feel somehow lacking, somehow losing something. Tragedy should no longer exist within the 21st century. To be a playwright, a poet, a novelist with no tragedies, just open-ended, open-ended, just like the universe. Just like the universe, I thought. Just like the universe condensed and expressed. Foot massage. Boy, the messages, the messages, the messages.
beyond time and space. Self-confidence is a state of grace, and when I'm low, what a blow. And I stay high and stay high, and high and high and high, up through the clouds, through the clouds. Boy, all those hands that move to show you what time it is. Sometimes it connects. I feel like I've found God or the gods. Sometimes you see yourself in everyone. And then you break the fluidity and stop like this. To be outside of your mind, like another dimensional frame, to be outside of your mind and speak nonsensical until you find sense. Yes. Beyond present tense, past tense looking in, present tense looking out, and future, boy, the suspense, dismantled, settled, thawed, corrected. <laughs>